sunny morning, a group of scientists got together to search for a very special animal. Aha! Professor Buckler! Oh, Professor Wolf! Oh, oh, uh, are we ready to set off? Certainly are, Professor Hijinx. And I couldn't be readier to... <laughs> got the binoculars. The water bottles and maps. Then let's go! someone else who also wanted to go on the search for the special orange-crested chimpanzee. Ah! Another scientist has joined us. You are Professor... Ooh, ooh. Ah, ooh. Professor... Ooh, ooh. Very glad you're here. Very glad, very glad, very glad. <laughs> We've never seen an orange-crested chimpanzee before, so we'll have to keep a very close watch for any chimp-like creatures. Hmm, now, we know the chimps are very good at copying. Ah, very good copying, Professor Oo. <laughs> Just like the orange-crested chimpanzee. We know the orange-crested chimpanzee likes to do a little dance when they're happy. <laughs> oh, yes, <laughs> Professor Oo. Oh, oh. Wow, you really do know your stuff. And of course, we know that chimps love bananas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you like bananas too, Professor Oo. Well, I'm sure with you along, we're going to find. See an orange-crested chimpanzee. <laughs> and so the four scientists set off on their exploration. Ooh, it looks like we're on the edge of the big banana forest. <laughs> headed into the big banana forest where they hope to find something very special. We're getting close, but still no sign of the orange-crested chimpanzee. Hmm. Let's go over our list again. We know that the orange-crested chimpanzee is very good at copying. Yes, and we know that they love to dance. <laughs> and they love bananas. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> were so happy that they danced around just like, well, like chimpanzees. I mean, orange crested chimpanzee. Time for a quick photo. <laughs> And so, the scientists went home happy and with lots of amazing photos. Come on, let's go do some more dancing. Yeah! One day at home, Rosie, Mia, Davy and their mum were just hanging out together, having fun. And so, they all lived happily together. Wow, that was a nice story, wasn't it? Yeah! Oh. <gasps> hey, Omo, have any of you seen my special ring? It's missing. Oh, no, Mum. That's your favourite thing. It must be lost. What are we going to do? Mama's ring's gone! Of course, everyone wanted to help Mum find the ring. But how? Well, each of them thought of a different way to get Mum's ring back. Hmm. I'm going to be a scientist and look for clues. And I'm going to be a tracker and look for footprints. Oh, ring prints. Any sort of prints. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, I'm, I'm going to uh, help. Oh, thanks, everyone. Oh, I'm sure all together we'll find it. We can make it our indoor mission. Yay! Yay! Let's, Let's go! go! <laughs> so everybody in their own way got ready to help. Take a look at things really closely with my magnet. 
to find us. Wow, that's a great idea, Rosie. I remember we were on the couch reading before. There are cushions on the couch, so it makes sense that the ring could be under the cushions. Oh, yes. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, did you find it? No, but I found my missing ducky sock. Hi, Mum. Oh, wow, Mia. You look like you're on safari. I'm looking for tracks, so maybe I can discover which way the ring went. Aha! Oh, uh -huh. Did you find it? No. But my tracking skills have found my missing hair clip. Ah. Just then, Davy came in, but his mum wasn't quite sure what sort of clothes he was wearing. Wow, Davy, who have you come dressed up as? Well, I'm dressed up as me. I'm here to help guys. Ready to go. Let's go. Whoa. Oh, Davy, watch out. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh. Davy, watch out. Oh, sorry. sorry again, guys. Well, Davy didn't feel like he was helping much at all. But luckily, Mum knew what to do. Davy, give me a hug. It's a team effort, remember? OK, Mama. Oh. Hey, Mama, what's that in your pocket? <gasps> it's your special missing ring. <gasps> Davy, you found it. How cool are you? Yay! Davy was the hero of the day. Great work, Davy. Oh, imagine that. Hey, I must have put it in my pocket while I was making your lunch. Oh, thanks for helping everyone. And a special thanks to Davy. Yeah, great work. Our missing ring mission was a success. What a great indoor adventure. Hey, do you guys want to go and sing another song? Yeah! <laughs> Once there was an elf called Twinkle Toes who was very good at wickle stick. I love wickle stick. It's my favourite game in the whole and here come my teammates. Hi, Barry. Oh, hi, Twinkle Toes. Look at my new wickle stick. It's so wickly. Oh, hurry up, Sparkles. I'm coming, I'm coming. I've just been practising my dribble. Ew, gross. You should do a napkin. No, not that sort of dribbling. Dribbling with the ball, like that. Oh, phew, what a real leaf. And here's Pumpernickel. <laughs> Pass the ball to me, Twinkle Toes. Oh, over here, Twinkle Toes. Over here. No, oh, to me. Pass the ball to me. Hey, Twinkle Toes never passes the ball. Go! Ah. Ah. My turn. My turn. My turn. Ah. Here we go. Ooh, I'll take it. Yeah. Hey, you can't take the ball off someone on your own team. Go! Ah. If we don't get to pass the ball or dribble it or score any goals, what's the point in us being here? Yeah, Twinkle wants to do it all. Toast doesn't even need us. Let's go home. So the next day, when it was time for the big match against the trolls, only Twinkle Toes showed up. I'm all ready for the big match against the trolls. Yeah. Hey, where is everyone? Where's the rest of my team? Did I do something wrong? Hmm. Let's think. Training. I dribbled well, I scored goals well, and I passed the ball. <gasps> Never. No wonder my teammates are upset with me. I did everything myself and no one else got a go. 
I better go say sorry. And that's just what she did. Hey, Mary, I'm sorry I hogged the ball. Will you please come play the trolls with me? Oh, I don't know. I promise I'll pass the ball and let you score goals. Oh, really? Oh, really, truly? Really, truly, truly! I promise from now on I'll be the best team player ever! Oh. All right then, come on, guys. Group hug! Yes. Yeah! Oh. Oh. Now let's go play those trolls! Yeah! Pumpernickel, you take it. Oh, come on, Mary, it's yours. Oh, oh. Yeah! Oh, I can't believe it! I just got it! And so the owls were able to beat the trolls and win the big game. Yeah! Where goes Dick? Where goes Dick? Now, come on, guys, let's head over there for some more fun. One day, out on a farm, a strange thing happened. A spaceship landed and out popped a visitor from outer space. Greetings, Earthling. I am Zam and I come from Planet City. Oi. Oh, hi, Zam. I'm a mud-loving piggy from Planet Earth. Ah, my bus bot phone tells me about piggies. Oink, oink. Oh, now you're talking my language, Zam. Oink. Then in dropped Max and Daisy, the two kids that lived on the farm. Wow! Who's that talking to our piggy? Dunno. Looks cool though. Hi, I'm Daisy, and this is my brother Max. Where do you come from? I am Zam, and I come from the planet City Oid. Here is my greeting card. Oh wow! Your planet's so shiny and amazing. And it looks clean, not like our muddy farm. <laughs> oh, mud, mud, yobby, yobby, mud! It was all so new and exciting for Zam that they decided to take him on a grand tour of the farm. This is our barn, where we keep the hay to feed the animals. And it's made of wood, not shiny, clean metal. Amazing! Yeah, but not as good as mud. And these are the cows that give us milk. Cows and pigs? Wow! And here's our muddy farm, where we like to play and get really dirty. Mud is so much oink fun! Dirty? You mean you like getting in here and getting dirty? Yeah! Don't you? Oh no, not on Planet Cityoid. I've never been in mud before. Well then what are we waiting for? Yay! Yay! And Daisy, Max and Piggy showed Zam how much fun it was to play in the mud. Oh, it's so slimy, dirty and muddy! I told you it was fun! Could I please borrow some mud to take back to my planet? Oh, you don't have to borrow it. You can take as much as you like. Oh, oh! A call from home. I have to go back. Thank you for showing me the farm and especially the mud. Oh, that's oik, oik, okay! It was great to meet you, Zam. Oh, I just wish we could keep in touch. Oh, we can. You can use my BuzzBot phone. Oh. Now we can call you whenever we like. And I can call you my new friends, Daisy, Max and Piggy. Oink, oink. It's so good to be in a wonderful place that's open and free. It's so good to be in the most interesting place that we have ever seen. Oh, I can't wait to take this mud back to my planet. They're going to love it. Yeah! And so, Zam headed off in his spaceship and Max and Daisy took off to take a bath. OK, guys, let's take off for another song. Yeah! Yeah! One beautiful...
beautiful day in the sea, some mermaids and a merman wanted to play catch with a very special ball. Oh, hey Finn, go get the big pearl from the giant clam. Yeah, it's time to play catch. Yeah! <laughs> hey, the pearl's not here. Where do you think it's gone? And what's this piece of coral doing in here? Hey, that looks like the coral that grows over at Olive Octopus's reef. Hey, maybe someone's borrowed the pearl. Well, the best thing we can do is go exploring and look for it. Yeah, Let, let's, let's swim! swim. mermaids went around the next reef, they ran into an unusual sea creature, a diver. Wow! Mermaids and a merman! Hi, I'm Diver Ben. Hi, Diver Ben. We're looking for our missing pearl ball. Oh, fancy that. I'm searching for something too. I'm looking for some rare golden seaweed that grows in this area. Oh, well, maybe we could search together. Yeah, let's swim! So everybody swam around the reef trying to find what they were looking for. Olive Octopus's coral reef. It sure looks like the piece of coral we found in the clamshell. This is Olive's reef, all right. Hey, what's that strange sound? Come on, let's explore. Yeah! The four new friends swam on and then they saw an amazing sight. Wow! There it is! The rare golden seaweed! Is this your piece of coral? Oh, good. Glad you found my clue. So it was you who took the pearl ball? Sure was. I came round to play catch, but you guys weren't there, so I borrowed the pearl. But it's tiring playing catch with eight legs, and I got super sleepy. But you did lead us to the golden seaweed. Yeah, with your snoring. <laughs> well, let's play a game of catch. Yeah! yeah! Okay guys, time for some more fun and games over there. <laughs>